Sound. What is sound? What's the real power of sound? Is it just what we hear? Is it tangible, touchable, feelable? What is the depth of its power? What is the source of sound? Who are you? What are you made of? The secret code of this universe is resumed in one ancient book. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning with God. All things were made by Him, and without Him was not anything made that was made. In Him was life, and the life was the light of man. And the light shined in darkness, and the darkness comprehended not. The secret code is the Word, the Word made flesh, imagination. What is the Word? Isn't Word sound? Vibrations? Everything has a frequency. We know that everything is made out of vibrations, don't we? It induces matter to move, to become alive, and to form everything out of nothing. The Word and the only law. That is how all took form. Infinite intelligence vibrates your life into matter out of the first gifts of life. Love and faith. And that's how you became. And that's how you became. What is matter? What is it made of? The word vibrates its energy from the core of an atom till the infinite universe. It beams its light into everything you see, hear, touch, say, think, and feel. Its infinite intelligence is the core of the ultimate field of potential, taking form into the matrix of matter. Everything is one and eternal. The ultimate law of one of the universe. What is a wave? What's a frequency? Almost everyone knows about the word vibration, but how does it work in the dimension of matter? To have a wave, you need two poles, otherwise nothing would simply exist. Everything you live are waves submitted in two poles. Positive, negative, north, south, day, night, hot, cold, female, male, pleasure, pain, faith, fear, life, death. You got the picture. One turn of the earth on itself equals one day, 24 hours, one cycle. 365 days around the sun, another cycle. A thousand years on earth has nothing to do with a thousand years on Saturn. Saturn has its own cycle and frame of reference. One day is like a thousand years somewhere in a galaxy because its cycle has a different point of reference. Every atoms of the universe of matter have poles. It's mostly empty space under two poles in its infinite range of frequency.